Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing Metopia again. If you missed the last episode, who cares? You know, it's alright, you don't have to spend every moment of your life with me. I'm fine, it's... It's fine. Mm. But for a bit of context, uh, basically it's a game where you play with your Mies and uh, an evil villain is stealing faces. That's kind of all you need to know. We got Turg and Little Kev up here <laughs> having a little chat. Let's check on the party. Oh, they're setting up ground rules. Keeping it clean makes sense. Okay, he's, he's talking about the inn being clean. Can I have the whole world being clean? Is he planning something? That is worrying talk, to be honest. We should clean the entire world. Oh, Little Kev doesn't want this food. <laughs> well, you know what? If you don't eat that, you get nothing at all. Let's go out on the road, folks. Let's get out of the inn. Oh yeah, we're on our way to rescue Mario over here. Oh no! It's a me! A budget to Mario! What do you say? You're a Nintendo fan. No. <laughs> I've upset the game. What? They're trying to guilt me into buying an amiibo. Uh, no, you don't get to see my amiibo. You look at her with her smug little face, because she is amiibos and I don't. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Let's find some butterflies with people's faces. Oh, look at that. It's, uh, butterflies with people's faces. Attack mistake. What? Huh? All right, well, whatever he did, it worked. <laughs> Good job, murdering boys. <laughs> On we go. I'm getting blisters. Dig a hole. Ah, oh, yes, I've always been one for good advice. <laughs> to talk about how hungry they are. Yeah, sorry for not feeding you guys. <laughs> I mean, little Kev is a chef. Cook something up yourself. Oh, what have they found? Tough pat, easy pat. Well, they're starving. So go on the tough pat to distract them. Oh, sweet be Jesus. <laughs> this might have been a mistake. <laughs> Honestly, this music slaps. Why do the goblins stand like this? I don't, I don't understand. It's really weird. Wait, he's got a new skill. Home cooking. <laughs> okay, maybe he is too hungry to fight. He's getting a bit distracted. Wait, what? He's being too kind to the goblin. Showing off for a little cat. <laughs> okay, that impressed me, but uh, now you're dead. Sorry, peeps. <laughs> he just dies. But don't worry. The gift of divine powers here. I, I don't understand. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, he's here. <laughs> I couldn't see him under his hat. I thought it was a rock or something. Okay, now don't feel sorry for them this time. <laughs> Just kill him. He's having mood swings. He's going from let's clean the entire world to oh, poor thing and not attacking. Yes, two faces released. Oh, and he's doing a little encore. <laughs> he gave little Kev a little wink. <laughs> Little Kev's like the most annoying Pokemon ever. He just keeps healing himself by doing some home cooking. <laughs> there we go. All the faces have been released into the atmosphere. I'm, I'm kind of worried about this though. Like what about the consequences for that? What if it's causing like global warming or something? All those faces causing a hole in the ozone layer. It's time to face the facts and stop polluting Turk. <laughs> My reward for taking the tough path. Wh why would I leave it? I need to know what's in the mystery box. Lots of money. And now they found an inn. God, these businesses, how do they survive? They're out in the middle of nowhere. There's no one else here ever. It's just the two of them. Yeah, the two of us. <gasps> there is someone else here. Someone's at the door. Who could it be? It's a new adventurer. Defeating the Dark Lord would be difficult with just the two of you. So I called a new adventure to come and join your party. Thank you, God. Now I understand why all these bad things are happening. You're too busy trying to help me and Metopia. Oh, I appreciate it. Default, I choose you. <laughs> that would be the worst Pokemon ever. Default, default. <laughs> what would they attack me? <laughs> Just have tackle, that's it. What sort of personality would you say default has? I guess cool. <laughs> and we'll just go with the default class warrior. <laughs> I am default, I am here to join you. Or not. I'm indifferent on the matter. <laughs> Turk wants to buy some casual treads. They're like starving. He's like, God, I would really use a fedora right now. <laughs> I mean, my lady just showed up. <laughs> Gotta be her white knight. And little Kev wants a non-stick frying pan. <laughs> oh, that is great. I can't help it. I have to give it to him. I know the frustrations of cooking with a, uh, without a non-stick frying pan. That is pure suction. Equip that little Kev and enjoy it. Goblin meat for you, Turk. Oh, he loves goblin meat. Thank God. <laughs> Little Kev's face. He hates it. <laughs> Look at him. He really doesn't want it. All right. Default will get it then. Indifferent. What a surprise. All right, Little Kev, I'm afraid you don't get to eat then because you're so picky. To be fair, he keeps cooking for himself when they're out in battle, like mid-battle, and he's not sharing any of that food, so I don't know if I should be feeding him in the inn. Well, look who it is. I'm assuming this is the Dark Lord, otherwise I I might have picked the wrong voice. Oh, it is him, okay. <laughs> He's just floating there menacingly and somehow Turg didn't see him. You just keep turning up like a bad penny. 
What does that even mean? <laughs> Let's dance. Oh, they're actually gonna fight. Oh, wait, someone saved me. Oh, I need to make a mage. <laughs> hmm, who would have jumped in to save me like that? Who is that brave and selfless? Other than myself, of course. <laughs> The music and everything. It's the powerful mage, Grognak. The destroyer, attorney at law, MD. Oh my god, look at this. Great sage, Grognak. Attorney at law, MD. Jim Pickens is deciding to let us live. God, this will answer the age-old question. Who would win in a battle, Jim Pickens or Grognak? Attorney at law, MD. I like to think that it's little Kevin default singing that song off to the side. What? He's talking nonsense. <laughs> Crockneck doesn't even understand. Or else their amnesia is making them forget it in real time. Who the hell is that? All right, I just thought of something. Maybe I can download Amiibos and show off to this Mario wannabe. What up, loser? I downloaded a Waluigi Amiibo. I hope this works. Oh, oh, is it working? Thank you so much. Amiibo are so great. Why don't you take this? I got three game tickets. I, that's not as exciting as I thought it would be. I thought it might add Waluigi or something or... I, am I play a song with Waluigi or... I, I don't know, I, I didn't really think it out, but I just thought something cool would happen. Well, now I'm just sad. What's this dank cave? Let me enter here. Oh my god, they're talking about Grognak. They're overwhelmed by Grognak. What the hell is this? Banshees? Banshees crying crocodile tears. Little Kev is unmoved. <laughs> he has no heart. Oh, is a me acting strangely? I mean, they all are, because they're all so feckin' weird. Cool quirk indifference. <laughs> Little Kev is crying in the background. <laughs> oh, that is perfect. Little Kev is crying. Turg is singing on a song. <laughs> and default is indifferent. <laughs> now Turg is singing and crying. <laughs> oh god, both of them are dead, and little Kev is just crying in the background. <laughs> now he is also dead. Maybe we weren't ready for the cave. Alright, arcade. Use game tickets to play. I, I can get prizes or rock, paper, scissors. No, uh, get prizes and roulette. Put it all on black, Turg. Also, oh, I can get different things <gasps> weapons megaphone? get that megaphone come on please please megaphone come on megaphone oh god damn it i was so close i don't want a royal portion i want a megaphone everyone knows the way to be a funny youtuber is just to be louder <laughs> and give xp to default i'm not good with emotions i know she won't give me any so it's just easier to give gifts to her and she'll just be like okay <laughs> and then it's done please megaphone please <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I want the worst thing there as well. Like, come on, I'm not asking for much. Come on. Yes, this has got to be it. Yes, megaphone. Give the megaphone to Tarek. He can sing his songs through it. This is the sound of silence. Okay, we're ready to set out now. Now that we have our megaphone, we're ready. Run out of this feckin' cave. What are you doing in here? Let's go talk to this weirdo. Serious soldier Merrick. All right, Merrick, what's up? I'm afraid I'll have to ask you to turn back. What? Oh, come on, Merrick. Why you gotta be so serious? Shout at him with the megaphone, Turk. So I have to go through the cave, or else I've got to go do something else to be allowed through there. God damn. All right, let's try those mermaids again, then. Wait, no, not mermaids. Banshees. Yeah, I always get those two confused. You know, beautiful singing, horrible shrieking. <laughs> kind of the same thing. <laughs> oh my god, they almost one-hit default. Oh no, poor, poor little Kev. Oh my god, Turk just jumped in front of him. Even little Kev is shocked at that. Oh, that was sweet. Look at that. They love each other. <laughs> now is not the time though, guys, please. We're mid-fight. <laughs> Default does not care about your crying. Don't even try it. Oh, and little Kev is feeding the team. They're a good team together. Except for the fact little Kev have, keeps having episodes. <laughs> what is happening to Kevin? Oh my god, the only one not crying is Default. <laughs> How is that thing still alive? Okay, thank God. The frying pan sent it to hell. Oh, he's feeding them again. He's the best little chef ever. Oh no. <laughs> he was the best little chef ever. Come on, come back in. Yes, it's a 3v1 now. I like when he was eating the food little Kev gave him. He kept the megaphone up, so it's like some ASMR for the Banshee. Just your moist chewing, you know? Come on, default. The final strike. Let's go. Jump slash. This is new. Nope. That, all right, that wasn't as cool as I thought it would be. I thought that might finish off the battle. It would be 
kind of epic. You know, up oh, the non-stick frying pan is the one that finishes it in the end. I think we won. <laughs> yes, Tariq, when all your opponents are dead, you have won. Please don't find another fight, because we, we literally cannot win it. Like, that was such a struggle. So default, do you have a war cry that you use in battle? Of course. There we go. You drive me neutral. <laughs> Perfect. Now, for feck's sake, it's another fight. We can't win another fight. Wait, who are these losers? Maybe we can beat these. Just get out that non-stick frying pan and start frying them up. Oh my god, they're getting absolutely destroyed. They must be so feckin' weak. You drive me neutral. <laughs> oh god damn it, our chef is down. All he needs is to attack one more time and Turk would have been victorious. But no, we lose to little jellies. Tactical retreat, folks. Tactical retreat. <laughs> What is this? Maybe sort of likes a uh, Turk and little Kev are falling for each other. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we'll have to try that cave again next time. It didn't go so well. I think I need more snacks. I think that's the problem. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. This game is very fun. I just love that we're entering all our characters into it. But I think the fact we have like a Kevin cinematic universe built up and we're entering all these characters just makes it so funny to me. But uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I appreciate you watching. If you want to see more, do let me know. Um, I also post every day if you didn't know already and uh, I stream over on Twitch. The link for that is in the description if you, if you want more of me for some reason. But uh, yeah, that's it folks. I hope you enjoyed. I appreciate you as always and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.